Well, this is a photo of an inflamed pregnant belly. Mm -hmm. This is circulating online. It obviously is a little bit alarming when you look at it. So what is this? And can you really have this kind of reaction to pregnancy? Yep. So what's going on here? So it's called PUPS and it is common in pregnancy. So it looks worse than it is because these moms actually do fine, but it's really annoying because it's an itchy rash. So it's an itchy rash that moms frequently frequently get around the third trimester of pregnancy. It can start in the abdomen, but then it can spread to other areas of the body, but mom and babies do fine. What's scarier than pups is when you get a, the itching without a rash. Now that's more concerning in pregnancy because that's due to something called cholestasis of pregnancy, and that can be associated with intrauterine fetal demise, but well, that, not this. Well, this can condition scar no, they usually do pretty good so after delivery. This is not stria. These aren't stretch marks. This is. She has stretch marks, and she has pups. She has. So what does pups stand for? Puritic urticarial papules in pregnancy. How often do you see this in pregnant women? It's pretty. It's pretty common in pregnant women, and so usually we don't have to do blood tests or anything to diagnose it. We just look at it because we see it all the time, and we say, "Oh, that's what you have," okay. and then we control the itching. We help you with that, but. Mom and babies will typically do fine. Pops. Very cool. Yep. Well, and it leads to one other reality. We always talk about good prenatal care. A lot of things can happen during pregnancy. That's why you need a good OB like Dr. Needle. <laughs>